Hello guys, and today uh, will pretty much be the release of Unturned again. So this is Unturned V2, it's been changed so much from V1, and a lot of people can't wait for it to be released. I'm going to try to get some recording as soon as possible, that is if it doesn't lag like an FPS at all, and show some of the things that you can do. I'm pretty sure I won't be the first person to give a gameplay video out, but I am going to try and get some uh, some of the first gameplay videos. Um, you can see all the ideas here we've worked, well I've mostly worked on, but you've all seen them. And I'm hoping that some of these have been added into the game. I know some of these like bullet drop, craftable melee weapons and such, I know those have been added. And I really hope that uh, we can see more of these ideas, or like the different types of grenades, the food and water giving you certain abilities slash disadvantages, like gun age, gun jamming, and so much more. If I had to pick like maybe five ideas out of my whole list to be added that is not already added, oh that would be a tough one. But I would say these crate drops, the different types of grenades, the gun skills, um, like passing out and like the blood, low blood effects, like from Daisy and such. Let's see, one more, one more. Hmm. Uh, what else could we have oh, that I, if I had to choose? Well, uh, 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 bullet specific damage would be nice. <coughs> um, and skill trees. I would love to see all five of those. Those would probably be my top five out of all these ideas so far. And. Because I just like those ideas a lot. I think the different types of grenades are going to change the game. So you you have like pretty common smoke compared to the other grenades. I can use those smoke grenades to like blind my enemies somewhat. Tear gas and flashbangs. And then you get like a normal ball type grenade. And you have like these World War II pineapple and other types. And supply drops, they'll just be random, they'll contain guns, ammo, building supplies, all that stuff. And gun skills will allow me to work on my gun skills and get that skill level with those the gun I like up pretty high. And skill trees will just be overall pretty good. And then the low blood effects, I would find out a lot of fun since... Since I love to try being a hero, I'm not just like the person who likes to shoot on sight because I can. And being able to knock people out from shooting them, sort of like, uh, just sort of like in DayZ, I could probably shoot someone with a gun and probably knock them out. That would really help me. Sort of like the Lee Enfield could knock people out. I think the Lee Enfield in DayZ maybe is a one shot knockout. Like, that's what I've heard, but I think it's I think if him in the chest it's a knockout or something. And then from um, having low blood, your blood level being a certain level, then you just randomly can pass out at times, which is realistic, and it would make being a hero so so much more easier. So it makes. It makes my job and other heroes' jobs just like easier to do, so we don't have to kill people. So, sort of like somebody's coming too close to our base, I normally would kill them, but if I can knock them out, I would try to knock them out and uh, spare their life, if possible. So, I hope that's added and. A I hope like uh, 
it's not like Uncharted V1 where it wasn't very much to do. It was mostly, <clears throat> if you played single player, kill zombies, get a good loot storage, and build your base in single player. And then once you get tired of that, get some guns, find a server IP, go and kill people on a multiplayer server. I mean, I would like to see a single player that would allow us to test things out. So, like, we can do survival and everything by ourselves, practice base building, practice with the guns, play around with the zombies, and just learn the game outside of fighting with other players. And then be able to join other players and play with them. Be able to enjoy a PvP or PvE or just building a base with somebody. So that's probably going to be it for this video. I'm probably going to go play Minecraft a little. And uh, if any of you are interested in like maybe starting up a clan, I am going to try to start up a clan of heroes. Or uh, actually the hero thing is probably going to be optional. I just want to get a, a small clan up with some people that know how to play the game. And... Uh, other things. It would be super helpful if you have Skype or TeamSpeak 3. I would prefer you have TeamSpeak 3 since I could probably use TS3 while playing Unturned. Since Skype is so laggy and so pretty much useless, honestly. So, if you're interested, put in the comments below or message me your Skype name or TeamSpeak 3 name and we'd probably try to set up a start up a clan. So, thanks for watching guys. See you in probably an hour or two for the next video.